So, welcome back to what I believe is part 22 of the series and part 2 of this um, special, well part 2 of the uh, um, generated structures. So, last time we came through this door from the woodland realm, I'll just go up to show you again. You wouldn't want a horse to do that, otherwise you have to mine it. So, really impressive structure. And then they start exploring it now. We should be doing this and Erebor today. And then next episode we'll probably be doing Dale and... Hmm, let's look at map. Sorry about that, I had a crash. So we're going to look at... So if we go to Dale, then we could go there, but I don't really want to. Rune... We could go to um, we could go to Edoras next. This is the next episode anyway, so that should be fun. Oh, this is interesting. Very interesting. This is quite a cool throne actually, compared to all the others I've seen so far. Pretty cool. Oh, I like that a lot. Big stay there, you're going to jump off the cliff, I know you are. Yes. Right. Oh. Let's continue exploring this place now. Hopefully that's not it, otherwise that'll be a bit pathetic, but... That shouldn't be it, I don't think. This is one of the best places I've seen so far. I haven't actually seen that many, so I can't really use that as a speak term, but... Let's continue moving. I'm gonna go left here. Oh, we got a prison. That's cool. Are these. Yes, you can open these. These are quite cool. I like this building a lot. I might. I might set a base up here. It's so cool. It's obviously nothing but. Um, elves will spawn here, so we got no danger. Okay, that, that could have definitely been worse. This is going to be a bit of pain. Did not expect that. If you, again, have any um, place where you want to go, the comments will do for that. And hopefully my um, Gondor tutorial will be out, so I'll, I can actually explore Gondor. Because I wasn't able to in my last episode because it's glitched out. So I'll go onto my generator structure world and we can explore it there instead. Hit me. Where does this go? Just here, just ends here. Okay, we saw another path back here, so I think that'll be going to take us down to the barrel place. Best to be like suffocated there. That's this it. So it's, it's a really impressive place, but I would have hoped for just a little bit more, if you know what I mean. Just it's a it's a little bit empty. Oh, 
I want some like wood elf houses, that'd be cool. Or like that pool you see. With these mithril. Oh no. That's not boring. I was gonna say I'm gonna get rid of half my mithril. No, just up to three. I'll take three mithril, but I don't want to take any more because I'm spare powers. So I'm stuck down here. Oh no, I'm not. That's good. I don't want to bring my pig to Erebor because from what I know, it is haphazard at best. So I'll dig a hole out the front, and then he can stay in there. It's very cool this, except I would just like a little bit more from it. Uh, how do I get out of here? Ah, oh, here. Have you ever been to that bridge? Oh yeah we have, that's the main way. If you know any secrets about any of these, put in the comments, because someone said there was one in Baradur, which I found, and it's really cool. So we'll probably be going there on this playthrough, because I'm not negatively aligned with Mordor so far. I have my Gladrium coat on. Or cloak on and I can get through places easily. So what I'll do is I'll deposit my pig in here and we can cheaty travel to Erebor. Come on. There we go. You can tell when it's a generator structure by this open plane. That will usually give you a good idea if it's generated or not. So we go north. Oh no. So not negatively aligned with these guys, but I'm sure they were might be money money past them. Shouldn't be too long, I don't think. <laughs> I've got enough food for this to be okay. So, how are we aligned with... Durin's folk? Oh yeah, we're quite aligned with them. Oh, this looks promising. But I can't remember when there was a massive bridge. I'm sure there was, but... You expect it to be... Yeah, this is cool. It's really impressive. It's far more impressive. Coming through the night, I think. That's really cool. We're going to go in there in a second, obviously, but I'm going to go up this bridge first and see what's up here. I'm really excited to go in there, that'll, that'll be really cool. It may sound like I'm less excited, but I'm just very um, snotty in there, so that's the reason. Oh, this is like the Raven Tower, isn't it? So this is before, this is, so this mod is set in after the Hobbit, isn't it? So it's resettled. So this is rebuilt. I think Dale's also rebuilt. Obviously there's a couple of ruins in um, Eriador. That's where Arnold used to be. There is some good stone work here. I can actually get stuff from here. Going to Gim 
I'll take that. I don't know who it is. I'm sure it's one of the 13 dwarfs, though. If any of you can read that, which I'm sure some of you probably can from the analytics, except if it's, except if it's Russian, because there's no Russian in the um, analytics, but if you can read that, much appreciated if you can put in the comments. This is a very long tower. Oh, there's nothing here. Oh, it was a complete waste of time. Um, yeah, I just shove everything in this large pouch. Right, let's go down. I'm sure that dwarf and Basaf is probably. This is obviously custom from the um, Russian or Slavic language. Is Slavic language the right word there? Who knows? Could be massively offending people, but. To walk down this massive hole. I'm um, imagining you all really want to get me to get to um, I know, I know, but at least it's not Mithril. Gandalf is down there somewhere, which is a bit weird. Oh, this is interesting. Oh, um. very confusing. It's quite maze-like here. Let's see, is it Mithril lined or is it silver lined? Mithril. I can actually do that, and I am going to do that. So I feel as Mithril's cheating. Oh, look here. Good news. So what I'll do is I'll chuck all this in here. I just feel like um, the Mithril, it just it just feels like the hours I spent mining it already is wasted. So I'm not gonna really take that out. I've spent that out something like the um, one before. Him. Be like a secret tunnel compared to what dwarvens or dwarven usually like. I'm sure there is the um, way to get in somewhere, but it's meant to be secret. I'm sure they've made it secret. Sorry about the um, slow noise, which will probably be here. It's because it's going to get hot today, and I don't want it to get too hot, so I've got a fan. It doesn't really work if it blows hot. Uh, into my face, but better than nothing. Yeah, I like the way there's lots of dwarves here. It makes it feel more alive, rather than if you just to get it on a normal map, it would feel like it's just completely deserted. Bit weird back there. Okay, so what's up here then? Chest. Yes, this is a bit overpowered, but I'm going to take it. 
It's here for a reason. Is it sharp? Lucky. That's very good. I'll take that. I mean, I won't not take any of that. That all looks decent to me. Oh, we're running out of pouches. We'll have to go for a resupply mission a bit. Or if we find any more pouches. Right, excuse me for a second. Oh. Um, Hopefully, um, edit the sound, we also need to cough. It's not coronavirus-y, it's just a little bit, um, coldy. But if I don't edit it out, it's not edited as well, I don't think. <coughs> Alright, we back again? Oh, I probably didn't edit that out. So sorry if you don't like coughing. Sure, it makes you feel a little bit weird at the moment. So let's go to the main event, which I'm really excited for. So I wanted to go with the day because it just means I can see more. I'm sure there won't be much lighting in there. That's really cool up there. That alone is very cool. Now we come to this amazing thing. I find that really interesting about the sunlight in this mod. Like, why would they think that's something that should go in the mod? I'm not saying it's a bad thing. I'm just thinking, how did they come to the conclusion? Oh, this is before the glass turned into natural glass. It was more just white over glass. Right, let's see if this is actually Erebor or if it's sort of Moria, because Moria was sort of arable. Oh, this is quite cool. Look at that. That's very cool. This is really impressive. How have they made this? I have absolutely no idea, because I've tried to make arable before, and failed miserably. <laughs> it's really cool. So here. Uh, Shoot, this is mine. Yeah, you're not getting out of that. It's all mithril trimmed, isn't it? Yeah, nothing in these houses, I wouldn't imagine. Because doing a whole interior for something this size would be an absolute pain. From what I know from the mod, um, from the wiki, this is on the wiki, the generated structures. Most people who have made these are from Eastern European languages. Either Russian, Polish, Balkans, one of them. I know Balkans is in a country, but I can't name every single Balkan country. If if any of you here have actually made one of these, I'm sure no one here has actually made one, but if you have, that's not a ladder, is it? Um, I'm expecting this to be a massive deep pit, so... Yes, it's a deep pit with nothing in it. I've fallen in there and probably died. You know, I don't need any of that, because mine out. But if any of you actually have made this, put it in the comments and then that will be massively impressive. I'm sure none of you here have, because you've got plenty of things to do with your time. But, like making incredible maps. Good thing actually up here if I walked up these stairs for no reason. Well, the 
this is really cool. There's a weird door over there we'll go to. Hopefully we get a chest in here. What's this? This is really cool. Yes, this is really cool. Look at this. This is really amazing. It's like a viewing platform. It's the Arkham Stone then. I'd expect that to be a piece of Mithra or Mithra Mugget, but I want to see if it's there. Gandalf, we're basically here where you would have wanted the adventure to be. You're too late. We're at the adventuring place, we're at the destination. I'm not sure why I have a dwarf battle axe in my hand the whole time. I just feel like I usually have that with most of my other... How did they get in here? How did they actually get down there? I'll jump down. Oh, here. Well, this is cool. Sure, I'm never be able to get back out of here again, but... That's a sacrifice I'm willing to make. So none of these have anything in them. That was close. I don't know what happened there. I think my finger slipped. How did we get that? Other side, maybe? Yeah, other side. So you have to run away the hot. That was really close. I die a lot, so that's not, that's expected, isn't it? <laughs> I wouldn't expect them to be building with oak wood here. That seems a bit odd to me. These prisons? Yeah, these are prisons. With bedrock. It's a harsh prison. You have to. You're never allowed to come out, and you have to starve in there. Right. Let's look at here. This is really cool. Like, I don't know if you can get the, like, majesty of this. This will be a good screenshot. That's a good, um, thumbnail. I wonder if it'll come out as good as in the pictures. Imagine if this is actually real. You'd be walking along here with no handrails. I would just be petrified of falling off the whole time. You'd trip and then you'd fall to your doom down here. I should not be doing that because I'm going to fall off eventually. I'm not sure this is actually what it looks like, but I oh, can go down there a second. So we'll check around here first. Boom, boom, boom. Running the wrong way. Oh, I want to see what's down here. Because obviously this is the... Actually, where does this go? Because it doesn't go to the um, pathway. It just goes to the other side. Oh, almost messed that up. Go back here in a second, but uh, look what's down here. Look what's down here. There's going to be a room. Oh, it's just this. Oh, no. Just 
strength from Walker. The lanterns of 1.16 would be really effective here. Oh, these actual houses. Yeah, they are. So, it's good to know that if I get extremely... Because this is obviously custom made. Because it's got no chandelier. It's got no things on the side. I'm sure the chests aren't custom made. But, other than that... Really impressive. Is there, a, is there an armory here? I want to see if I can find an armory. It's really cool the veins of this. If there is an armory, I probably won't be able to find it now. But can someone in the comments say if there is one or not? I know I usually like the wiki, but I can't find a wiki for individual buildings. Is this, does this go out into a cave? What's that? That gold? Well, this is impressive. And this is the, this is the, yeah, this is the special one, so you can't do anything with it. So I will take it. See you in a second. I just need to go and do something. Flying back, it's only been about five minutes, so I'm still fresh in the mind of what this is. So I actually didn't even hit this guy. I'm not sure what you use to... It's instant, is it? Here we go! The lag is necessary. Hmm. I wonder. If there is anything on the side of this. Well, I could run. Obviously, going over the top is not an option here. That would be ridiculous, but. This isn't. I like a golden staircase. It being far, basically faster than instant is a bit of an issue. a part of gold. Okay. I know what we're doing this round. We're going to go to Lake Town as well. That'll be good. It's always King Gundabad Orcs. Don't want to. Too much effort. The murder failed. How he survived that, I have no idea, seeing as that dwarf over there obviously fell from a similar height and died. But, let's see if we can try and find an armory now. I'm sure it would be... Where do you think it would be? 
It might not be in the main room. It may be. Ooh, could it be along here? Let's have a look. What's up here? Is it up here? Oh, there's something up there. Yeah, but it seems to be nothing. Just a big walkway. I want to go to that big walkway. I wonder where it ends up. It's actually meant to be a walkway. Quite dark this bit. Ooh, what's this? Absolutely nothing. Just a random room. See, ah, oh, that's annoying. I'd expect an armory to be down there somewhere, or down there somewhere. Maybe it's back in the main hall, but I doubt it. So, let's see if we can find one. And if not, we will go to the gates of Dale. So there's nothing there. But who knows there are random houses which end up being pathways. No, that's the main hall. I would say what would have been cool is they actually had an arc in stone. I think that would be really... Yeah, it's just cool, basically. More, um, like the movie, or no, just everything. More like the book. The book is actually less... So the book's much more kid-friendly than the movie is. It's very interesting how they decided that they would make the movie far more Lord of the Ringsy. Right, I can't find one. If you, if there is one here, put it in the comments, please. I, I want to know if there's one. So let's now cheeky travel to Arandale. This is cool. This is really cool. Let's put a moat. I'm on the path. Where's the entrance? Oh, there. Look at this! Well, so, if you want to see this, uh, that's my next video. See you next time. Hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching. See you next time.